Let's look at Hubert Hercage's forehand to supercharge your forehand. There's one position in particular you can copy from him that's going to give you power and control, and I'll show you why. But let's look at the position. It's this position right here, hand, elbow, shoulder, all the same height. When he takes the racket back with both hands, he has it in this position where the back elbow is up. It's not collapsed. Most recreational players, they drop their elbow and their swing becomes way too large. Check video footage that you have your hand, elbow, and shoulder all the same height when you take the racket back. This helps you not break the plane, meaning that the racket goes onto the non-hitting side of the body. The racket should stay on the hitting side if you can help it, because that means you can handle the pace of your opponent's incoming shot. The second thing this does is it helps you to close the racket face. Notice that his strings are tilted down. If you're someone who lacks topspin, meaning you lack confidence in your ability to keep the ball in, it's because you're not tilting your strings down and swinging up through contact. Having this back elbow up makes it so easy to tilt your strings down. You're going to get a ton of power from this position, coiling with both hands. You're going to be able to handle the pace of your opponent, and you're also going to be able to control the racket speed you're going to generate. Now, the best way to practice these techniques is at home with a Topspin Pro. You can get a Topspin Pro using my link in the description. I'm also going to pin it in the first comment. I absolutely love the Topspin Pro, and I know you will too. And if you're looking for people in your local area to play matches against or practice with, or if you want to find a coach who's close to you who can help you with your game, use my link in the description and pinned in the first comment, playercourt.com slash two minute tennis. When you use my link to sign up, you get 50% off. So simply go out and film yourself hitting forehands from the back view and check the footage and make sure that your shoulder, elbow, and hand are the same height when you take the racket back. You do this, there's no doubt. You're going to gain confidence, win more matches, and play much better tennis. This is Ryan Reedy from 2MinuteTennis.net. You got this.